Bachelorette number one is a mentally abused shut in from a kingdom far, far away. She likes and hot anytime. Please welcome Cinderella. You a mean green machine. Together we'll scare the out of anybody that crosses us. Now, Ogre. ogres, oh, they're much worse. They'll make a suit from your freshly peeled. No. What have we got? Well, I've got a fing donkey. <laughs> right. Why don't you go your own? Hmm? I found some <laughs> shit. Awful stuff. And I'm not going to myself. Hey, wait a minute, I got a great idea. I you. You gotta let me Please, please. Okay, okay. But one night only. Oh, no, 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 no. Dead off the table. Where are we supposed to put it? I put up signs. I'm a fing ogre. Hey, don't look at me. I didn't them. Oh, gosh, no one us. What? You're not a king yet, <laughs> but but you can become one. All you have to do is a princess. Can I you? Uh, what? Can I you? Please. Of course. Really? No. Got the knife. Cut open their and drink their fluids. Does that sound good to you? Everybody loves. I don't care! Well, cool. You f the dragon. I'll f the stairs. I'll f they butt too! Wait, Sir Knight! This beeth our first f Should it not be a wonderful, romantic f Because that's what friends do! They f each other! Oh, yeah. yeah. You're right, Donkey. You can tell Lord f Quad that if he wants to f me properly, I'll be waiting for him right here! You f me deep, Shrek. You f me real deep just now. Donkey, I'm warning you. Who are you trying to f Just tell me that, Shrek. Who? Everyone, okay? <sighs> they f me before they even know me. That's why I'm better off alone. Oh, man, I can't feel my d I don't have a d I think I need a hug. I forgive you. First f me in the b Oh! Maybe you can f me in the f sometime. I'll cook all kinds of shit for you. T Rex. T Rex. Triceratops. Triceratops. Brontosaurus. Brontosaurus. Micropachycephalosaurus. People who sing like that should be drug out into the street and shot. I've shown my dick to people I work with hundreds of times, and they love it, not just because I'm the boss. Hi, I'm Marty Schaefer, president of Schaefer's New Zealand style products, such as Dick Sealant, Dick Hardener, Dick Remover, and my personal favourite, the Dick Sucker. Until recently, we used to refer to those all-important office presentations as PowerPoints. But in today's office, dicks are on the tip of everyone's tongue. And that's why our latest product focuses on the many dicks you're exposed to at work. Schaefer's New Zealand-style dick presentations. Guys, let's show them all the different dicks they can buy from us. Running a company can be challenging. And that's why I communicate to my clients and employees in the clearest way a man can in the corporate environment, with my dick. Oh, sorry, there for me, Barbara. Yeah. Even though we have all sorts of dicks, fast-paced dicks, flashy dicks, interactive dicks, inspirational dicks, persuasive dicks, and dicks just for the holidays, you can't just rock up to a meeting and whoop your dick out. Before I show my dick to anyone, I put it on the biggest screen I can find and then spend up to two hours poring over every detail of my enormous dick. It's the longest one at this office. Everyone's eyes widen when they first see it, but once they get their hands on the hard copy, they get the feel of my dick, and I like watching them do it. If your dick is boring, people can easily doze off because they've seen a dick like yours before. But with Schaefer's New Zealand-style dick presentations, you'll virtually slap them with your dick. Jim, wake up. What was I talking about? Your dick? Good, Jim. 
It's a good sign if Jim is following along. He's seen so many dicks, I'm convinced all he dreams of are dicks. No more dicks. Get it out of my face, I've had enough. Poor little guy. I've got to go now. I've done such a fantastic job presenting my dick around the office that I've got a meeting with the head of human resources. Hope it's a promotion. Cutting, I'm the president. I can do whatever I want. You wanted to see me, Kathy? Schaefer's New Zealand style dick presentations. Try our dicks. They're easy because they're not hard. The college? I'm glad I took off one day in the middle and just f***ed around the hive. You did come back different. You going to his funeral? No, I'm not going to his funeral. Everybody knows you f*** someone, you die. You don't waste it on a squirrel. He was such a hothead. So you'll just f*** us to death? We'll sure try. <laughs> <laughs> it must be so dangerous being a pollen dog. Oh, yeah. One time a bear had me pinned up against a mushroom. He had one paw on my throat, and with the other, he was f***ing me back and forth across the face. Oh, my! Dad, do you ever get bored f***ing the same f every day? Son, let me tell you something about s***. You grab that dick and you just move it around and you stir it around. You get yourself into a rhythm. It's a beautiful thing. Mm. Okay, you got a rain advisory today, and as you all know, bees cannot f in rain. And a reminder for all you rookies, bee law number one, absolutely no f***ing humans. I gotta say something. She's my f I gotta say something. Yeah. I am a bee, and, uh, you know, I'm not supposed to be doing this, but oh. they were all trying to f*** me. Humans? Humans? I can't believe you f humans! Giant, scary humans! What were they like? Huge and crazy. They f*** crazy. Oh, no, 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 you're f***ing a human florist! Well, well we're not f***ing. She s*** my f and she understands me. At least you're out in the world. You must f*** a lot of girls. Mosquito girls try to trade up. F*** a moth, dragonfly. Mosquito girl don't want no mosquito. How did you get mixed up in all this? Because he's been f***ing humans. What? F***ing humans? He has a human girlfriend. Whose side are you on? The bees. I f***ed a cricket once in San Antonio. Man, those crazy legs kept me up all night. That chiwa. Because you don't free bees. You f*** bees. And not only that, it seems you thought a bear would be an appropriate image for a jar of honey. Well, they're very f***able creatures. Uh he's just a little bee. And he happens to be the nicest bee I've f***ed in a long time. Long time? What are you talking about? Are there other bugs in your life? Not in this fairy tale, sweetheart. I'm gonna go f*** the marshal. You do that! Wait a minute. I think I'm f***ing something. What? I don't know, but it's strong and it's pulling me. Mary, we did it! You taught me how to f***! Yes! No, high five!